Chapter three, when God looks different, is really a chapter about when God decides to move in a different way you're not used to, what do you do? When you have the disciples that are fishing all night and they haven't caught anything, and Jesus comes and tells them something ridiculous at the time to throw your net on the other side. I mean, I don't really know the space between this side of the boat and that side of the boat, but Jesus tells them to do something a little bit different than what they were doing. And because of their obedience, the harvest that they reaped was out of this world. It was incredible. And I think when we read this story, we can realize one thing, that it's not moving the nets to the other side that caused them to be filled to the brim where the nets were almost breaking with fish. It was the obedience. And this chapter really does embody what do you do when God looks different and you trust him and obey him? What do you do when he asks you to do something maybe that wasn't in your plan? Do you trust God enough that if you throw your net on the other side, he'll fill it?